I am so excited about this because after a long wait, Tanner, the Netflix show Russian Doll is finally back for season two. So I sat down with Natasha Lyonne and the cast and they dished about shooting in the New York subway and what song they would want to hear for eternity. Oh my. Check it out, Tanner. Natasha, you know, the, the, the subway is a central character in, in this current season. Do you have any weird subway stories? I feel like you've had experiences on the subways from some weird you've seen. I would definitely say though that, yeah. uh, you know, uh, shooting in the uh, the bowels of the MTA, uh, when the city is shut down with a pandemic in the dead of winter is up there. You know, one of the things that we had to do in order to shoot down in these subways is uh, take something called track class. And one of the things mm. they ask you to do it is the most insane thing you've ever done in your life is you put on a hard hat, you go down to the rails, and you stand in this little arc, which is called uh, a murder hole. And subways, live <laughs> trains pass you in both directions, and you are not moving, and it is the scariest thing you've done in your life. Yes, had I seen all kinds of crazy things, but has anything been crazier than actually being down there in a murder hole? Nine. I laid down in the bottom one too. You know, there's a there's a murder there's a murder. Uh, what is it? A crevice? I guess you would say because it's like the ones underneath the train as well. Now, Greta, you know, you played the best friend in this, and I feel like your character deals with a lot of crap. But I want to know in your own life, are you the one dealing with crap from your friends, or are you giving the crap to your friends? Let's go oh, there. God, you're gonna have to call them up and ask them that question. I don't know. Uh... I mean, the true sign of of, of insanity and, and that kind of psychosis, my answer would be, no, I, I'm, it's them. Because <laughs> you're perfect. Yeah, I'm, uh, yeah, I have everything figured out and yeah, no problems, yeah. <laughs> um, Chloe, you know, in, in the first season, Gotta Get Up is is played, you know, every episode. So if, if you were gonna have one song that you had to listen to for eternity, what would that song be, Chloe and why? <laughs> Oh my God, one song for eternity. Um, more than a feeling? <laughs> Uncool song on the planet. <laughs> All right, so Chloe named More Than a Feeling by Boston. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. if you could only hear one song for eternity, Tamar, I want to know, would that song be Unbreak My Heart? Let's break this down right now. <laughs> I'm sorry to break your heart, darling. It would not be unbreak my heart at all. <laughs> I love my sister. I love her music. But I'm a huge Mariah Carey fan, so I cannot live without a Mariah Carey song, period. I would like to hear Jolene by Dolly Parton. I love oh, her. Wow. Oh, that's yeah. a good one. Yes, I love one. Jolene. She begged not to take her man, Andrew, and I sure would love that's you. That's true. Yeah. Gary. Yeah, that's like you <laughs> Don't take Gary's man. No one's He's coming not for put Gary's up with that. man. And Russian Doll Season 2 drops Wednesday on Netflix, so be sure you check it out.